disclaimer before the video starts a lot of information that i'm mentioning in this video and a lot of information about the game in general and hollow progression as well as partial res can be found in the public hueco mundo discord just join the dis just join the info discord and then join the hueco discord and then you can find anything everything there in the information tabs there's also tabs about where the harbel npc can spawn in the item spawns and people usually post it there and you can find them there the first step to get partial res is to be is to become grade 2. You know you're grade 2 by looking at the leaderboard and it says grade 2 next to your name. And once you're that, you can move on to the next step. The next step is you got to find an NPC that looks like this on, that looks like this on the screen. It looks like Haribel. And my best tip for you is to server hop the castle. There's over like 8 spawns that I've counted that are uh, at the castle. And I'm going to show you guys like most of the spawns right now. So the first spawn is actually right here on this rock. I've had their spawn here a couple times. And the second spawn on, is on that rock over there. The third spawn is in this room. She can spawn in here. And she can also spawn in this room right here. I thought I actually saw her. Um, the next spawn is that she can spawn in this room right here. And she can also spawn in the stairs. So she can spawn in this little corner in the stairs as well as the other corner. Finally, I've seen screenshots that she can spawn inside the laboratory. These green parts in the laboratory. So just check here as well. Um, so yeah. yeah, that's over two, four, six, seven. That's that's nine spawns that are right next to each other, and there's probably more that I haven't mentioned. So yeah, the best way to find the NPC right now is to just server hop the castle and just hope for the best. Anyways, the the third and final step is to get once it talks to you. You gotta find your item. So the item um, is like a representation of what res you get. I'm gonna put a list of the res you can get on the screen right now, and the item will correlate to any one of these reses. So for example, if you get bone res, the item you will need to find is related to a bone. And if you get acid res, the item you will need to find is related is related to acid. Same thing with all the other reses. So just a little quick tip for this video and fighting and finding your item. The method I used was um, every time my item wasn't in the castle, I really didn't bother looking for it. And I instead, I left the server to re to make it so it goes on cooldown. And I gripped, pe I gripped three people instead and then went back to the NPC uh, in the castle. And I just did that over and over and over again until my, my, uh, my item was in the castle so it would be easy and quick. You don't have to do this, but this is a really easy method if you have an alt as well. I didn't use an alt, but if you have an alt that's like the opposite race, like it, like a Quincy or a, a Soul Reaper, this is an extremely easy method. You just have to grip your alt three times, and then it's off cooldown, and then boom, you can go find your item again. You're going to have to go all the way to a void that has like big spikes on it, and you jump in, and then you do the obby, and then you click on at the very end of the obby there's like a little black orb and you click on it and then boom there you go there's your partial res so it is subject to change because um a lot of people are complaining the obby is extremely hard so it may change in the future and the obtained method may change in the future as well the, it already actually changed um before if you failed the um obby you would have to go to the purple orb inside the castle i'm gonna show a screenshot right now and then you talk to the purple orb and then you get the item again and then you go to the void. That is changed now, apparently. I actually don't know exactly how it works, but you don't have to get the item anymore after you failed it for the first time. I'm pretty sure you just talk to the orb and it either TPs you to the thing or you just have to jump in the void. You just have to um, jump in the void again. Anyways, I'm gonna show a quick sped up video on how to get to the void you jump into from the castle, and I'll see you guys in a bit. your item make sure to be out of combat and jump inside the void video again i'm not entirely sure how the new system works where you only have to get your item for the, for, uh, for the first time but yeah that's pretty much it for the video i hope you guys enjoy good luck with getting your partial